This is going to be a different video for today. We're going to talk about how we can recharge when we feel and experience some type of tiredness, exhaustion, and a sense of feeling extremely overwhelmed. When you experience overwhelm sensations, it's because you're living in the future moment. You're thinking about all the tasks, all the things that need to be done, and possibly you're thinking that you might not be equipped or good enough to achieve all of those ideas and big goals. You begin to spiral down into a place of sadness, unsure of yourself, and a desperation of quitting. You, my friend, are experiencing self-doubt and are quickly leading into burnout. So first things first, what is causing you to feel self-doubt? What is causing you to feel unsure of who you are and what you stand for? It's important to do some reflection on yourself and dig deep of why you're experiencing these limiting beliefs. Take the time to journal your thoughts and your feelings. Pick up some books that can help you navigate thoughts and if you feel you need to talk to someone, call a friend or talk to a therapist. There are many ways for us to step back and analyze the bigger picture, but it's hard for us to pull ourselves out before we dive deep and too far. So what are some steps you can do to avoid burnout? Take the time to find your purpose. What do you feel called to share? Why is it so important to you to show up in the digital space to share your message and your voice? How can you do this type of work? Ask yourself these questions and keep asking your why. Another step is to take note of what is triggering you to spiral down of self-doubt and feel burnt out. Are you making too many promises, not being realistic with your time? Are there some people you're surrounding yourself with, those that are making you feel like you're not enough in this space and you should be doing more? Write it all out and take note when those feelings arise. If you're making false promises, come back to your roots and to your truth. Everyone will understand if you come from a place of honesty. Being realistic with time is so important. This takes patience and understanding yourself as a creator. And you'll hear me say this often, but if there are people online that are triggering those feelings from you, mute or unfollow. It's not fair to you or them. In most cases, these feelings are about us. It's a reflection of what we're going through. You can't blame other people for these feelings. It's up to you to put in the work to dissect what is truly going on inside. Once you do some shadow work, you will begin your journey of being unbothered, which we will chat about another day. I talk more about this on my podcast, which you can find under Brat Babes Throttle Talk, and it's season two, episode 33. It is called How to Avoid Burnout as a Dirt Bike and Snowmobile Content Creator. I give a little more insight, steps, and tools that you can take to avoid this type of burnout and how we truly can recharge. I believe it's so important that we stay in tune with ourselves and learn how to navigate life with the right tools to live a full, abundant, full life while doing the things we love doing, such as dirt bike riding and sledding. I will leave the link to Apple and Spotify podcasts along with the video link to this particular topic. Thank you so much for listening in on this heartfelt message, and I hope you can get out to ride. Keep killing it safely and be the vibe, and until our next hangout, bye for now.